Adventure Ninja. Pale Dawn. Generic greetings, fellow citizens of the internet. Today, I bring you an episode not of the Daily Minecraft Loaf and not of any other sort of series that I've started already. This is something new. Um, I am on the Pale Blue Dot server, uh, which I'm happy to say that I started. Um, I think it was a good idea. It's going well. Uh, we've got a few people involved. Um, I mentioned this in my uh, uh, Daily Minecraft Loaf. Possibly other places as well. And I have already posted um, some footage which I will link in the description, possibly in annotations if I'm feeling ambitious, but I'm not going to set myself up for that again. So, uh, I'm going to go ahead and get started. Um, I want to quickly show you around Spawn, you being the collective, all of viewers that might be watching this. This right here is my house, uh, as you can see from the sign. Um, and there are all my worldly possessions. Please note, very generous, very, very, very generous, um, little, um, gift. Halloween present, I think he called it, from Storm. Um, 16 diamonds. That's intense. Shows how far he is in this game already. Um, also you can see a good number of picks, uh, left over from helping, um, Klaus dig his gigantic hole. Because I've been bored, because I haven't wanted to record, and I've not wanted to actually go off and do any exploring or um, find a proper house yet, because um, I didn't want to do it when I was not recording. So, um, this is Spawn, isn't it pretty? Um, I've built most of what you see here, although individual people's houses was mo were mostly built by them. Um, You've got um, the spawn house, which we built um, all on camera, basically, and it was, or at least that was, you know, that was the first thing we built. Uh, we all sort of got together and did that. Um, I've recently built these two bridges going off in those directions um, for those people. Um, we've got a little wheat farm, some pumpkins going on, some potatoes. I've been living off them. As you can see, I've, got, I've still got a stack of 49 in my inventory. Um, then there's uh, Art's little house there, um, pretty compact, I helped him out with that a little bit, he still hasn't told me if he actually likes it, but I assume he does because he hasn't told me to change it. Here's our projects and trading board um, with some of the stuff that we're working on, um, and actually this, I'll change that later, but I am going to be actually building my base soon. Um, so, um, there, like I say, that's my house, there's the, um, spawn armory, then Storm's house, um, some quick rules that I set up, um, if you want to read that, I don't know if you'll be able to, you probably could, I'll leave it here for just a little longer, so that you can read it if you want, I'll just pause the video, anyway, um, so I guess I'm going to quickly sleep, um, yeah, dang it. Um, sun's going down. Go on, sun. It's okay. Go down. Go down. That's okay. Okay. Saw a star. I think that's the crucial turning point. Nope. False. I thought it was when you saw the first stars, that's when it was technically night, but apparently not. So that has been disproven. All right. Well, sleeping now. Um, excellent. Um, I think I'm actually going to gear up a little bit, grab another pick, um, I'll grab some wood, I don't have much, um, just bring that, then I don't have much that's useful, I've got the most random assortment of stuff, um, alright, that should be good, uh, do I have anything cooking? No, okay. Um, Anyway, so there's Ninja's house over there, um, then there's also, um, 
uh, board on which we put all of our main base coordinates um, and so on and so forth. I'll be replacing this sign later as well. Uh, you've got our compass rows, uh, north, east, south, west. It's all color coded. Yeah, color coded so that you know you can say that your house is in like light green, for example, like yellow green, um, or blue green, or purple, or whatever, in order to just indicate what direction it's off in. Um, Ninja, for example, is somewhere off in that general direction. Storm is off over there. Um, Artemis is that direction. No, Storm is over there. Klaus is over there. Um, anyway, whatever. Sooner or later, I'll actually probably go to everybody's houses and show them off and so on. Uh, I'm going to assume that Klaus has shown this on video by the time I'm posting this. Um, uh, as you can see, I made a few improvements. Um, it's amazing what three half slabs and two buttons will do, but now it is quite cute. I thought it needed it. Um, so, uh, I thought that would be nice. We've got a quick little cactus farm going here. Um, a sort of cobble mine sort of thing going through here. Um, I encountered silverfish here and it threw me off like nothing. Um, I was not expecting it. I was, not, I was certainly not expecting it at this level, and I wasn't expecting a whole vein of them. I knew they spawned, I just didn't know that there would be whole veins of them, and I nearly died. It was bad. It was a problem. But nevertheless, um, so I think I'm actually going to go ahead and set off now. Um, I'll briefly check in the spawn house. Um, there was... Um, yeah, here we go. He've, we've got two maps um, that Storm made. Um, if you see... There, down there, um, that is, that's weird, look in the corner of the screen, the, um, <laughs> the other map is just disappearing and reappearing, uh, over there, you've got the map, <laughs> I didn't know they do that, I did not know they did that, but okay, down there, there's the village, you can see just a couple of the pathways and so on, um, and an open lava pit, which, um, is off behind, um, Klaus's house, um, then that's where, um, Storm's house is, off in the hills, in that a ways, that kind of direction. Um, and then if you look on this zoomed out map, there's Spawn, there's his house, there's Klaus's house. Um, I also happen to know that Art's house is someplace around in that way, that area. Um, it's just south of Spawn. And then Ninja is off over here someplace. I think she might be that dot there. Um, so that's where everybody is roughly. Um, and I was actually thinking about heading off sort of this direction because um, it looks like there's some cool stuff up here. And I was kind of looking for a desert for the sand um, as well as a jungle for the green grass. Um, so th I'm guessing this is a jungle through here. It looks jungle-ish. Um, and so I'm probably going to check out this area. Um, and we'll see what it looks like. However, if I don't like the looks of that, I'll just probably say to heck with it and keep going until I find something that I like. Because that's the kind of person that I am. How, how am I doing for daylight? Eh. Middle of the day. Um... Eh, whatever. Um, I'm hesitant to strike out in the middle of the day in as much as it's going to be a pain if I don't get where I want to go and I run out of daylight. So I will um, briefly cut and um, come back when I have waited out the rest of the day and slept. I guess. Alright, nice new day. Bright new day, bright skies, wonderful, everyone is happy sort of time. Alright, so um, as I mentioned before, we've got um, Ninja off sort of over there, uh, Artemis over there, Klaus over there, and Storm over there. So I was thinking I'd sort of head off in that direction. Um, by the way, here's the lava pit that I mentioned earlier. 
Isn't that fun? Um, but so if I head off in this direction, should hit the um, biomes that I saw earlier. Um, sugarcane. That's always good. Um, but if I can get jungle and desert, that's nice. Because I really, really like sand, sandstone, and that kind of thing. Hi, spider! It's okay, you're, you're peaceful. That's fine. Yep, don't mind me. Just don't mind me. That, that, everything is fine. I don't like spiders. I don't like spiders much at all. Um, I didn't really check the map for what I'd find in my way. I'm gonna get disoriented or something. Um, though I guess I can... Ooh, look at that! Now that that's that's fun. That's nice, isn't that? Is that good? That that's good. Okay, yeah, that's an excellent start. Um, this will give me some stuff to. What's that? Sort of a hole. I'm not gonna bother. Oh man. Yeah, okay, right then. Ah, oh, don't drown. Okay, we're good. Okay then. Anyway, no, 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 what I was saying, um, what was I saying? I was saying that, oh yeah, I, I was, I was just, you know, figuring I'd walk in just solid one direction, I was feeling like a very, very confused Kurt J. Mack going off, um, what is it, northeast, um, but I do think that this is interesting enough to warrant a investigation, this is bizarre, looks like somebody might have already raided it. I don't know. Yeah, cause I'll, oh yeah, all the creeper, creeper sandstone is gone. Yeah, there's a crafting bench. Okay, yeah, somebody's been down here. Though, so, did they not? Oh, they they did take they did take the TNT. Okay, probably raided the chests too. Then, um, all right, whatever. Um, all right, well, that got all my hopes up for nothing. Whatever. So, okay, well, let's continue this direction. Let's say, um, I'll continue in this direction. Um, this is still not a let's play. I'm still not going to treat this like a let's play. Not really. Um, I'm still going to be playing. I I'm the one gaming. I'm the one doing this. I'm doing the one doing that. Well, I'm the one flubbing his words. Um, and so, you know, you guys can watch if you want, but this is my gig, and I'm doing it because I want to. So there. Um, so, let's see, yeah, like I was saying, um, I love the, um, I love sandstone, and it's, it seems like, you know, between sandstone and stone brick, like, stone brick is really easy and looks pretty darn good, uh, it's really easy to get, um, versus sand, unless he's a sand generator, which I'm not going to do, um, I don't think, uh, I might change my mind on that, but... I don't think so. Oh, a village. Ooh, ooh, I wonder if this has been raided yet. I think this might be new territory. Oh, oh, yep, there are villagers. The wheat hasn't grown. Oh, I'm excited. Awesome, awesome. Uh, this is cool. This is very cool. Let's see. Um, yeah, we've got a big lighting error. That's awesome. It's wonderful. Um, oh, come on. Put me down. There we go. Um... Yeah, I might need to hang out here and block the villagers into their homes come nightfall, because otherwise they are going to die. Um, ooh, one of these guys has already been beset by unfortunate happenstance. Oh well, the rest of these guys are fine, as long as I've got two that survive, uh, everything is okay. Um, Oh, go away. Like, fall in the well or something. That'll yeah. actually keep you safe. Oh, that's that's depressing. Alright, whatever. Um, anyway, one way or another, um, I'm considering wandering around here, staying here, and uh, blocking these guys into their houses to um, keep them safe. At least keep two of them safe uh, until um, I can come back here. Was there an armory? Did I see it? Or a, a smith, smithy? Um, if there was, I'm gonna check the chest. I don't think there is, though. I think I... Yeah, no, I don't think there is. Alright, well. Anyway, um... 
<laughs> it makes me mad that I didn't wait till night. Um, but is there a house with two in it? I don't have to stop. I don't have to go. I want to keep exploring. Um, I don't think any of these houses actually have two villagers in them. Um, they're all. Yeah, I know they're all outside, enjoying the sunlight. Ah, curses. Once again, sunlight is the bane of my existence. All right. Oh, pumpkins. I actually have already found pumpkins um, en route to Klaus's house, but I will grab more, because you can never have enough pumpkins. Um, I guess I'll pass the time until nightfall. Uh, I don't know how long the episodes are going to be for this, um, but I'm just going to sort of keep recording until I've got... Lots of saplings, that's weird. Why are there so many saplings? I wonder if somebody chopped down a tree here. And then the chunks got unloaded and the tree finished decaying. Maybe this village isn't new after all. I don't know. I don't know. I know people have been out exploring in this general direction. So I guess it's not unheard of. And it isn't that far from spawn, so... It wouldn't be too much of a surprise. But, um... It's too bad that um, somebody just completely ruined that temple. I mean, the creeper sandstone isn't exactly difficult to make. Um... Those things look cool. But, uh, anyway, anyway, anyway. Oh, whoa, 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 Oh, these are carrots. These are carrots. Bad ass. Look at that. Oh, yes. I got me some carrots. We had potatoes, but nobody had found carrots yet, I think. Uh, which makes me think that nobody had found this village yet. That's cool. That's cool. Haha, I am the first one on the server with carrots. Aw, yeah. That makes me happy. Okay. Ha! <sighs> so I'm not really accomplishing all that much, am I? Um. So I guess I'm gonna... Hmm. I'd say that this is what I was seeing on the map. Um, this transition from forest... Er, from um, desert to uh, jungle here. But... It's not that big. It's not that big of an area. Like that that's not the it's not a huge um desert and this is certainly Oh, that's interesting. Okay, yep, I'm building here. Yep. Yep, this is gonna be my house. I might make another one at some point, like move out and go to some place nicer, but um this will certainly work for now. And look right there, there's iron. Ha <laughs> ha Hooray! It would seem that storm is shining on me. You see what I did there? The god's shining on me, and except it's storm, because storm is the god of pale blue dot. Never mind. Um, so, um, let's see. I guess I'd better set up shop. That's a cactus. Um, that cave up there is looking quite inviting. Do I have any torches? I don't think I thought to bring torches. That's stupid. Okay, well, I can make them easily enough. I've been messing about at spawn so much, I've got, you know, charcoal, all this other stuff, you know, in great supply, because I've been doing all these other tiny projects here and there. I'm curious as to what this is. It is nothing. Dang it. <laughs> oh, no, 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 it continues. It continues. It continues a little ways, anyway. Oh, that's kind of neat. Oh, yeah, that's neat. Oh, and it continues over there. Or something continues over there. Oh, this is nice. This is cool. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I like this. I like this a lot. Yep, I'm moving in. I will move in right about now. Uh, so let me dump a crafting table into the wall. Um, I'm going to need to actually work pretty fast, uh, given that the sun is going down. But... Uh, let's see, I'll just mill it down. I've got trees aplenty all over the place. Make me a bed. Plus the bed down there, given that I'm probably going to need to move it. I'm probably going to want to move it, you know, as soon as possible. Um, oh, this is nice. This is a cool area. Ow. 
um, pretty up the entrance way a bit at some point. I'm definitely going to need to have some kind of window or something in my bedroom when I eventually make my bedroom properly. Um, because I like to be able to see, you know, exactly when it gets nighttime and then, um, you know, sleep at exactly the right moment and so on and so forth. Oh, I didn't shut the villages into their houses. Um, I should have. Because that's just, that's just a safe way of doing things. If these chunks are going to be loaded, um, at all at nighttime, then there's always the chance that bad things might happen. I'm surprised that I just messed with myself like that. Wow. Wow. <sighs> oh well, we've got we've still got villagers through here. What kinds of trades are we offering actually? I didn't check before. Ooh! 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 This guy wants emeralds for melon slices. I might be able to accommodate that. Um bread, that's a lousy deal. That was a lousy deal. Yeah. Um cooked fish. I might be able to do that if I can't get a better offer. Um, what do you want? Less cooked fish for an emerald. Okay. I'm going to lose track of who I haven't checked yet. Um, I definitely want to save the melons guy, because I think Storm found melons, but I'm not sure. And um, that would be a really nice way to um, get some melons really easily having to actually go mining. Though don't get me wrong, I do like mining and it'll be fun to, you know, search for abandoned mine shafts and everything, but if I can do things easily, then that's often cool. Not that I will always look for the easy way out either, too. I might as well clear that up. What do you want? Oh, you're, you're the melon guy. Um, wait, there four guys over here. Who, who's new? Who's new? You're the bread guy. Who are you? You're a fish guy. Fish guy. Gravel and an emerald for flint. Oh, that's an interesting one. Hmm. Hmm. So basically, you're saving me time and maybe a shovel. Tech with that. <laughs> um, <laughs> no, I'm always going to go with the um, long and tedious, but slightly um, more resource friendly options um, uh, what was I saying oh yeah yeah, yeah. I'm not always gonna take the easy way out for example with like sand generators sand generators and everything like um, the machines that take advantage of pistons and sand duplication bugs um, in order to uh, get um, like infinite sand basically um, as long as you just keep the thing running um, yeah I'm not gonna be using those I don't think I'm pr I've pretty much decided I'm not gonna use those just because it I can't quite nail it down or anything but it does feel like it goes against an integral part of the game in a way I, it feels like it's sort of cheating sort of I don't know, but, um, I mean, and it, it's, and then it's, it's an exploit. I mean, I know it's an exploit, um, but, um, like, I'm just, it's not an exploit that I think I'm going to use. Um, do these still get broken with, no, I think they still get broken with fists. Okay. Or they, they do get broken with fists now as, or axes as opposed to, um, the way they used, yeah, wood half slabs used to need to be broken with um, a pickaxe, which is weird. Um, gonna do some, get some um, nice wooden pathways going through here. Uh, no good way to do this. Like that, like that, and then. No good way to do it. That and that. And I think I'll finish it later. Um, I'll make the pathway go like right across the water or something. That'll be cool. Um, and then um, 
yeah, I can finish touching up this house and make something really cool out of this. So, I guess I'll check back very briefly when I've, you know, spent an obscene amount of time and gotten a lot of cool stuff done. So, yeah. Peace out, everybody. Check back in just a bit. Kaboom. Hello, everybody. Um, so, I'm back and found this. Uh, heading over to Ninja's house, which is somewhere over in that direction. Um, from my place, which is somewhere off in this direction. I don't have the inventory space um, or the time to check that out now. Uh, but you can look forward to that probably next episode. Um, right now, um, gonna head back to the village and my base, and I'll show you what I've been working on there and so forth. Um, it shouldn't be too far. I should have made a boat. That would have sped things up considerably. Um, but, um, I'll make it here eventually. I'll say I'll make it here eventually. There it is. You can see that off in the distance. I said dive into water off a lily pad. Um, as you can see, uh, well, can't really see much right now, but uh, if you take my word for it, I have uh, put up. Uh, well, for one thing, I, I put on a you know sort of steeple onto the church, which makes it look stupid now. But whatever, I'll fix it eventually. Um, and I set up um, a wall around the place. Ah, it's a creeper. I'm going to die. I'm going to die. I am not... I'm not healing and I'm not... The creeper's gonna get me! Oh, that's a that's a skeleton right there. I'll just go right around here. Don't mind anybody. Um... It's okay. Okay, awesome. Two creepers spawn right there. Yep, right where I need to go. That's awesome. Awesome. Come on, come on, let's just go around here. No, no problems, no problems whatsoever. As you can see, I built this. As I quickly run past it, across it. Um, finished building it, and I think it looks reasonably nice. That's not, no, bad time to lag. Bad time to lag. Bad, bad time to lag. Oh my gosh. Um, I just need to go in here and sleep, sleep. Oh, it's my, ah, there we go. Okay, everything is fine. Everything is fine. All right, we're good. It was intense. I'll just let you, you, you burn to death there. Um, no, it's okay. It's okay, just burn to death. That's fine with me. F where'd you go? Fuck you too. Go away. Bad time for lag. What just happened? Awesome! Okay, well, we'll do this again. Awesome. Why aren't you burning? There you go. Oh my goodness, why am I lagging so much? This is bad. This is seriously not cool. Oh my god, I had so much stuff on me. Okay, seriously. Sir, sir, I'm afraid I'm gonna have to ask you to leave. Um... So I have done, oh, lots of stuff got everywhere. Um, I have done a bit of caving, not much. I wanted to do the bulk of it um, on camera, and I have yet to mine iron or anything like that. I haven't actually mined anything of consequence. Um, uh, is that it? No, I think there's, yeah, okay, there's something down here. My inventory should be exactly full if I got everything. No, I miss some. Where is, where is it and what is it? What did I miss? It's probably really blatantly obvious in the recording, so. Oh, I'm not seeing anything. I'm not seeing anything. Uh, okay, whatever. I didn't have anything really important on me, I don't think. All right, whatever, whatever, I just won't mind. Um, so yeah, I did a bit of caving in through there, um, you can possibly see, probably would have been easier to see when it was dark, but that cave's slightly lit up. Um, I've explored just a few caves around there, um, and I may as well show 
I don't want to go too f too long here because um, I don't want to drag this episode out too long. It's already like 20 minutes or something, um, like 25 minutes going on 30. Um, but I built this. Uh, I think it looks reasonably nice. Um, and I'll do something over with this area as well. Um, not liking the lag a lot. That's not fun. Um, but that's. You know, I put these archways in, expanded this area a little bit, took out the gravel that was here, um, and creeper blew up. <laughs> so I've got a nice big area here, uh, chest full of the most random stuff. I did make the trade with the melon guy, so I do have melons on uh, there, the um, diamonds. Um, I got slime balls from slimes in the um, uh, swamp there, um, cocoa beans from the jungle, all this other stuff, I've been getting some pumpkins as well, um, sandstone stuff all over the place from building a wall, uh, now I'll just head over to the village and show you what I've been doing there, um, I need to fix this walkway, um, like, I want to actually make it out of jungle wood, I never thought I'd say that, but I do think that those walkways, when I've used them in the past, they've looked better when they were jungle wood. So I'm going to try that. I'm also going to make it come out further, um, like arch or arc around so that it actually connects somewhere more around in here so I can, you know, walk across it more easily and it has a more natural shape to it. Right now it's like a right angle and it just looks terrible. Um, anyway, so um, over there is where I've been getting all my wood. Um, over there is a snow biome um, where I'll probably set up a snow generator, all that other stuff. Um, I don't remember exactly how snow works, and snow golems seem to not produce snow in some biomes, so I might. And I know they die in deserts um, and maybe plains, so I'll need to be careful with that. There's a sand quarry that I set up over there. That's spawn in that general direction. Um, over here, we've got village. This is the wall I put up around it um, with a little lip to keep spiders out. Uh, it's got these entrance ways. Um, I've prettied up the village just a bit. There's a cave down there that I need to explore. Um, I'm leaving this part messy so that I remind myself to do that at some point. Oh, come on, game! Oh, come on! Oh my goodness me. Ah, oh, but so... Oh, and there's a blank sign. That says Melon Guy, because this guy is the Melon Guy. Um, and after having traded with him, I did get another trade here. Um, then I eventually traded him some wheat, and then now I could trade for flint and steel, which I don't really want, but so on. Anyway, I did get these all, these guys all locked up into their houses and stuff, so they're all safe. Nobody died, nothing, nothing bad happened there. Um, and I repurposed some of these farms, so um, here I've got some reeds. Ah. Uh, <laughs> set up a map there. Um, I'll show that in just a sec. Uh, some more wheat. Uh, the carrots, which were here, but these are now potatoes. Then I've got melons here from the melon guy. Um, pumpkins and wheat. Um, and also my well. Um, this says, this is another blank sign, which is just a glitch. Um, I'll relog at some point and show you later, but, um, it's a secret entrance to my base. Um, and there's iron down there, which I haven't mined yet, because I haven't mined iron yet, because I wanted to, you know, not get too far ahead before, um, doing more stuff on camera. Um, so, yeah, I think that's the mo that's the majority of what I've been doing. Um... I've got this map here, um, same as the one in spawn. Um, that spawn there, that's um, that's Storm's house, um, Klaus's house, um, and Ninja's house, somewhere down there. And then this is where I am. And these maps don't want to show markers for the other maps. So there should be a marker somewhere out in here, and there should be one down here, because I gave Ninja a map as well. But, um, so hopefully that'll be fixed when we go to 1.4.4, which should be, you know, as soon as Storm gets around to updating the server. Um, 
but so yeah that's more or less where I'm at now and I think I'm more or less ready to end the episode and get working on some new stuff um, so that some cool stuff can happen I've got some awesome ideas about what I'm gonna do with this place and it's gonna be really really cool I can't wait to get started so um, yeah I guess I'll see you guys later Pale Blue Dog.